too entitled. This is like, how we do things here. So you you are coming to someone's country, and Americans do that in every country, Europe, Asia, Africa. Like, I mean, not, oh my gosh, I just said country. Oh, every continent, do that in every continent, like Europe, Asia, Africa. And they will go there and start making rules for the country they visited. And then it's like, what it's are like you a, doing? I don't know if it's like a natural instinct, like a natural colonization instinct. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But like, it's weird. They, they will literally come, like, because I was watching Emily in Paris. She goes to Paris and they're like, we don't need your American ideas. And she's just like, yeah, but I think, no, it's not what you think. Okay? Just let them, this is their country. You don't live there. Just go. And like people, like I've seen on TikTok where like, they get annoyed with like Americans coming to their country, like this uh, other countries and stuff like that. And they're like, yo, when Americans come here, they be so entitled. are from another like, country, drop your comment because I, I would love to connect with ooh, you. Oh, put your flags. To make friends, put guys. your flags down. Drop your Instagram. We are want to connect with different people. Like, even if you're American, like just mm -hmm. different, you know, we love like if you live if you're in America, put your put the state. People. I don't know, like maybe the state you're from, like maybe you're from Georgia. I don't know, okay? Because diversity is very important. Yes, and I love diversity. It's I love beautiful. international students. I love I like even me myself. If I didn't grow up in America, I would be an international. Student. I just think that. Oh yeah, yeah. We're not, we're not we angry. Just wanna, we like, just want to educate. I think it's about yeah. time the world. And I've seen there's a little progression because of apps like TikTok, and even there people be ignorant. I'm about to get in that, but like we just want to educate because even though like Africa started getting more recognition, people started getting a little more educated about it. There's still very much ignorant comments made about the continent of Africa. And even on TikTok, like some girl showed, I forgot which country she was from, but she showed like her beautiful, huge house. And someone said, I don't, they're like, it's ugly. Girl, I bet you don't even live in a house like that in America. Second, she tried to say it was musty. How's it musty? How, like, how's it musty? Like, because it's in the continent of Africa. Girl, she's rich, you are not. And the, I'm sure the person that, making that comment lives in like a like trailer or something. So it's like, how are you so entitled? You're apartment. you're poor in America and entitled and being rude to rich people who live in Africa because their house is bigger than yours. It's screaming jealousy. Like I literally have family members come here and tell me that this shirt from an expensive store is cheap. <laughs> I'm just like, huh? It's cheap. Like they can afford the things that I can't afford. Like living here things in the you can't US. Afford is not that yeah. like so no, now it's not that luxury right so now that all that has been said i'm sure there's a few more maybe i'll get more and say in a video one of these days but now i want to talk about how i started becoming comfortable with letting people know i'm african and it started little by little now i'm like really comfortable like once someone starts to know me, I want them to know right away that, like, especially if they're also from another country, I want them to know I'm from another Literally, country like, too. now I'm so proud I'm of my I'm so roots. proud of my roots. I've never like, been, I, I'm so proud. Yeah. I just love the fact that I get the best of both worlds, you know? I get to switch I, when I want to say something yes. that I don't want people to hear, you know, code like, switching. I just love my culture. So, I love that I get to go back to my, I have a, a land to go back to, like, my homeland and, you know, ex well, I experience. I have so much more to explore, even in my own culture, right, in my own homeland. I haven't been there in, in a, a while, long time, right. and like the beads and the clothes and the, oh, the waist it's, it's just amazing. amazing. Like I know, like when I you start, love when it. you start to it's appreciate your culture, you really realize, wow, I love my culture. Like when you see, like we get to put these things on our bodies that others probably can't, because we understand the meaning of it. It's just cool. It's I honestly fun, think beautiful. that having a culture or having a background is the best, best gift thing that anybody could have. Mm -hmm. it's, so it's going amazing. to I'm not now, ashamed of my right. Roots. So honestly, I'm not gonna lie. It was when Black Panther came out was when I was finally comfortable with letting people know where I was from because you know Africa was getting the hype after that. You know Wakanda forever and everything. And you know, as Africans watching that movie, it was funny because they were really yeah, trying to accent. They were really trying to accent. I'm like, it was we don't so talk funny. like that. And it was, it was so just funny because it's like they're really trying. I'm like, <laughs> I wonder how Lupita feel because she's actually actually. Chadwick's wonder, accent was just, like, <laughs> just like not it. Like, but hey, I give it to them. They tried, okay. The guy that acted the the monkey, I mean the um, 
he's actually he actually kind of did well. He said, he said we will not have you to yes. I was like oh, he yes, did so well. he did it because y'all know the Caribbeans they get it but like yeah so it was that movie honestly after that the way Africa got hyped like, I was like, oh, I think I can. Not all the black Americans want to be African and wear the dashikis and claim their roots. The ones that don't that, claim Just because of that movie. Right. And, like, so then I remember, like, going back to school, you know, like, people talking about it. No, let them get people, mad. People will be talking just about it. the truth. And, the um, yeah, again, we're saying, like, if you're African American and you don't, you don't, aren't like that then you shouldn't be offended don't be off because if you're offended then maybe maybe you're, you're this maybe you're a part of the problem too we're talking about the ones that unfortunately are being ignorant yes. yeah that when we're younger from what we just we based off of what we've what actually, we've actually seen. seen it's things we've seen see, we're not just coming here saying seen. things we have we whom it we yeah, whom it we saw it, it.